Hey guys, what's up? What's good? It's your girl Shakira. Welcome if you're new and welcome back if you are returning. Now this video is going to be a very quick one because this hairstyle is very quick, very easy, very, very, very cute. It is low manipulation and perfect for when your hair is just going through a lot. So if you guys are interested in seeing how I achieved this updo, this very cute updo that I absolutely love because it looks like a crown, it is super gorgeous, then keep on watching. Okay guys, so I am starting on freshly washed hair. You guys are going to see little particles in my hair and that is from my wash routine. I did not strain my aloe vera good enough so it left residue in my hair. So because my hair is super dry right now, I used the braiding method in order to stretch my hair. I love styling my hair when it is stretched because there's less tangles so I cause less damage and breakage to my hair that way unless I'm doing a textured hairstyle like a twist out um, a braid out or something like that then I would style my hair when it is damp other than that I style my hair only when it is stretched so right now I am parting my hair into two sections because I'm going to do two high ponytail get my hair up into my ponytail I am just going in with a wide tooth comb and I'm combing my hair as high as possible in the position that I think I want my hair and I'm just gonna use a hair tie to keep my hair in place right there while I go in with my brush and my gel to sleek my hair a bit now if your hair is shorter than mine I would suggest you guys try to put your hair up in sections because you cause less damage to your hair and you are not gonna put unnecessary tension on your edges my hair is at a length right now where I do not have to do that method anymore but when you have shorter hair you just have to take some extra steps in order to make sure your hair is cute and neat as possible while protecting your hair and your edges at the same time so I'm just going in now with my edge brush to take some of my edges out of my ponytail because I'm going to try to sleek my edges a bit. You guys know and I'm going to say it again, I'm going to always be saying it, I'm not really good at slaying my edges and my edges are not really that thick either so I don't really do too much to it but for this hairstyle because it is very simple I'm just going to try to style my edges as best as I can. So for my ends, I am going to be doing some twist because my hair is dry like I said before and I want to make sure my ends are protected. So I'm just going in with some moisturizer. By adding moisturizer, it will give that juicy look that I'm going for. They always make calls, always on that FaceTime. Something about when they're holding me late at night. Feels good but not right. For my hair length, I am just doing five jumbo twists. But if your hair is shorter than mine, you might want to do more twists so that your hair will look as neat as possible. And if your hair is longer than mine, you probably can just do like one or two big twists. For the one that's meant for me. Cause I know my worth and I know I'm worth it. So until then. So now that I'm finished with one section and I'm happy with the placement, the highness of my ponytail and the juiciness of my twist, I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. I know my worth and I know I'm worth it 
now to get the tiara or the crowned effect so you're gonna take the twist from the left side and you're gonna pin it on the base of the ponytail on your right side and then vice versa and there is no particular way in which you do this like I can't say okay put this here here and put this one there like you just have to play with it see what you like and just try to figure it out until you have something that you think you are happy with so now that I am finished with both of my ponytails and I'm loving how my hair is looking, I'm happy with the placement and I'm happy with how juicy my hair is looking. My hair is going through a dry spell right now like you guys have no idea, you probably cannot even see it but my hair is still looking juicy and nice so I like that. You guys want to make sure you are liking what you're doing as you are doing it. You know make sure you're happy with one step before you move on to the other step because if you continue and you're thinking oh my hair still my hair is still looking dry i do not like my part i do not like where my ponytail is you more than likely will not like the hairstyle when it is finished so make sure you are happy with what you're doing do it over if you have to before you move on to another step does that make sense and that is basically it guys so simple so quick so easy this hairstyle did not take me a lot of time at all um and it's a hairstyle that i think i will be rocking a lot more often because i absolutely love it i really hope you enjoyed this tutorial hope you guys like this hairstyle let me know in the comment section if you do and i will see you guys in the next video before you go make sure you like this video make sure you are subscribed and make sure you share i love you guys so much for watching see you guys in my next video bye